All right, back again. We just we just be working hard today. We got so many new songs to talk about, and uh, we got a new Rob Zombie track. He's back for Halloween, boys. He's back, and uh, he's got a new song out by the name of "The Triumph of the King Freak" and a bunch of other words that make it very very long song title. So we're just gonna call it the trim the the the, 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 the Triumph of King Freak. And I'm gonna be honest. It's nothing new. It's uh, it's Rob Zombie. I don't think we really need anything like you know, new, uh, because Rob Zombie is just a legend in his own right. I get a white zombie type feel from this. That's uh, was his band in the '90s, and uh, the best way I can say it is, if you like Rob Zombie, you're gonna like this song. I don't know if it's going to like change anybody and make them into Rob Zombie fans. I wouldn't say that cuz it's not like Dragula or you know any of the other songs. I can't think of at the top of my head, but you know, I wouldn't say that it this song would be the song that would turn me on to Rob Zombie if I was a new listener to it, but um I think it would intrigue me. Um if this was the first Rob Zombie song I ever heard, I'd be like, "Hmm, it would be pretty interesting cuz you know, uh, him and John Five, who is his guitar player, um, they have a really great chem- chemistry, and they make some really cool and <laughs> heavy new metal music. And it would intrigue me enough to want to know more. I would want to hear more. Um, it wouldn't. It's not my top tier Rob Zombie, but it's, it's good too. I'm gonna rate it a f- three out of five. All right, Schmidt Rock, telling you guys to have a good day.